Hey everybody, what's up? It's Nick here. And today we're going to be talking about the clone stamp tool inside of Adobe Photoshop. So the clone stamp tool is essentially used for eliminating parts of an image that you don't want to by replacing them with other parts of the image. So if we go over here, this is the clone stamp tool, and we're going to be using that to get rid of any little particles, dust, or anything that's just in the way of the picture. So as you can see over here in the corner, we have this little black speck right here, and that's actually a bird that flew into my shot that I didn't quite see while I was actually taking the picture. And let's say I want to remove that bird, and I want to replace it with a bit of the sky back there. What I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the clone stamp tool and make sure that it's sized to any way that I want to. That's probably a bit too big, so I'm just going to size it down and that's just fine and for the sake of this I'm going to zoom in to my actual photo so as you can see there's the bird now if I just click right here as you can see I could not use the clone stamp tool because there's no area that's selected to clone so what you need to do first of all is you need to hold down the option key on a Mac or the alt key on Windows and that'll make your cursor appear to look like this and then you want to take a sample from the area that you want to replace right here so I want to just pick this right here this is random gray bluish kind of sky Guy. I'm going to click right there and that sampled it and now I'm going to just if you see if you see that I'm mousing over the bird right now as you can see when I click down it will replace it with that so I'm just going to click and drag over and as you can see it's gone I replaced the bird with that little sample and if you can tell the little crosshairs that's above where the brush are that shows the area that has been sampled and the where that you're clicking so that's pretty much it it's a quick little tutorial on how to use the clone stamp tool you can use this to remove birds from your shot or remove dust on the camera's lens or just little tiny details in and around your shots to just clean it up and make it look like there's not something accidentally in the way so that's how to use the clone stamp tool thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye